This is a Choose Your Own Adventure DUI Edition Part 38. See how you'd do if you get pulled over suspected of a DUI. Okay, you've had probably too many to drink. You absolutely should not be here. And I shouldn't be here, but I am because of your choices. So now the officer has asked me, How much have you had to drink tonight? And I told him, I had a couple drinks a few hours ago, but totally good to drive. Which was a lie, but I thought maybe I'd slide by. No chance you're sliding by. When he asked me to do the field sobriety test. Just so I know that you're good to drive, would you mind stepping out for a field sobriety test? Field sobriety, there's no way I'm gonna get through that. So I definitely said no. Then he asked me. Would you mind blowing into this portable breathalyzer? And I also declined the breath because I know that's probably not gonna go well for me either. So I put myself in a position where I haven't given him any evidence, but the truth is you won't be getting out of here and driving this car yourself. Most likely in all the interaction that I've been doing, talking to him, handing him my driver's license, he has seen signs of intoxication. That's what they're trained to do. And the second I told him that I had drinks tonight, he started his investigation. So while I think I've probably been pretty good and not shown him, if I am over the limit, almost guaranteed I've showed him signs. So, unfortunately... Sir, I'm gonna need you to step out of the car. You're under arrest for a DUI. Okay, so now what do I do? Do I just shut up and deal with it? Let my lawyer at 1-800-NO-COPS deal with what happens next? Go to part 36 or if i think maybe i should try the breath now and see if i can maybe get under 0.08 and drive myself home go to part 39.